Now, as the snow fell on Central Texas, drivers found themselves trying to navigate some slippery roads most of the morning and afternoon. Six News reporter Barry Roy has been out on those roads all day long and joins us live with the very latest from TxDOT as we head into the overnight hours. Good evening, Barry. Yeah, good evening to you, Jasmine. I'll tell you what, if you're a fan of the snow, what a day it was for you here in Central Texas. As the snow came out quickly, it piled up uh, throughout the day, uh, not only in the neighborhoods, but up and down Interstate 35. If you were dreaming of a white Christmas and missed out, your wish was finally granted. It's all snow, no rain mixing in, no sleet mixing in. As the None snow that, moved into the area shortly after sunrise. The roads quickly became difficult to navigate as drivers attempted to continue their Sunday routine. Um, it's different, especially here in Texas, because it doesn't happen very often. But Brandon Bray said, well, it's not what people are used to. It's not too difficult if you just pack your patience, something he said some forget to do. It's been it's been pretty safe, but uh, you got to watch out for some of the semis. They they drive a little reckless sometimes. It seems like in the snow they forget how big they are and how much uh, snow and ice they throw off. Truckers start whipping past you because you know they're pretty heavy so they don't really care and then you just a couple times we got splashed and we couldn't see anything and me and my coworker were just kind of praying while central texans haven't seen snow like this in more than a decade they admit it's a learning curve behind the wheel oh it's kind of hard uh, i've came from gatesville and slid a few times on the way here but other than that it's not too bad as long as you know what you're doing in texas everybody loves to go fast you know so I would just say just go slow, take it easy, and get home safe. The roads improved in the early evening, but the chance for a slippery commute Monday is very real. So roads could really start to become a concern. Be extra careful on bridges and overpasses. Uh, these areas tend to freeze first. Buckle up, slow down, and give yourself extra time tomorrow. Now, Jasmine, I did speak with meteorologist uh, Zach Scott on the phone today. He says this is uh, the biggest snowfall in over a decade. He also says certainly the biggest snowfall of this uh, century as well. He also tells me that the snow that we got today, it will likely be one of the top 10 snowfalls for all of Central Texas, period. Reporting live in Temple, Barry Roy, 6 News. All right, Barry, you be safe getting home tonight.